on YouTube. Uh, I'm going to do another shaving uh, video here with a razor blade review. And uh, just in case you hear any little noises in the background, that's my son. He's uh, in the bathtub. I, I gave him a bath a few minutes ago, but he's still playing in the water while I'm making my video. So, all right, so let's get to it already. So tonight, I'm going to do another uh, razor, razor blade review, like I said, because I haven't done one in a while. Um, tonight, I, um, I had my wife pick the one out, and she just went in the bag and got it because I got a 100-pack of random blades um, that come from triblade.com and she just reached in the bag and grabbed one out. So tonight I'm going to be using a Persona Med Prep. Let's see if you guys can see that. There. Comes in this blue pack um, with actual uh, writing on the back. They're made in Verona, um, Virginia. Oops, sorry. And it has this little sticker on here that says, oops, Persona Med Prep. Alright, so with this one, there is no uh, wax paper in the middle, okay? And this blade um, looks a little bit thicker, but I think that's just the writing. It's still the same as any other blade. Um, it says, for hospital use, made in the USA, made in the USA in the corners. Um, it's got little black dots there on the corner. I'm not sure what those are for. You can see them, but um, that's what I'm using for my, for my blade. Uh, for my razor, I'm gonna be using my um, Mule R89 with my um, baseline handle here. Oops. To get a little bit more heft. For my soap, I'm gonna be using a, a Sterling um, scent. Be using a uh, Ozark. Hmm. Ozark Mountain. So it smells like uh, pine trees, Christmas trees. That's what my son s says it smells like. And then I'm going to pair it with uh, the Ozark Mountain aftershave that comes from uh, Sterling. And this stuff smells exactly like the um, pine tree stuff. So uh, the other thing, lastly, I guess my shaving brush is my uh, Shave Revolution 26 millimeter Badger Knot. It's been soaking. Um, I did a head shave earlier this evening. I took a shower a couple hours ago. Um, so my skin, face is all hydrated. Should be, I've been washing both my boys tonight. And this bathroom stays extremely hot in here, so the, from the hot steam, it's, my, my face is nice and moist. But I'm going to go ahead and moisten up. I'm going to put some of the bloom water on that I've had blooming for the past 5 or 10 minutes, washing my son. And then I'm going to start a lather, and then I'm going to fast forward through that, and then we'll get to the shave part. Okay, let's go. Okay, so you can see, I don't know if you can see on camera, I'm sweating here because it's pretty hot in here from this hot bath that my son's in. And also this Sterling soap always delivers on very creamy, foamy lather. Or not foamy, very dense lather. Okay, first pass with the grain. Alright, first pass done. Okay, with the grain here, it's almost baby but smooth. I'm still gonna go across the grain here a couple times. Oh, but I forgot to mention that I have about three days of growth. Uh, actually, two and a half days. Saturday, 
Friday afternoon, Saturday, and today. Um, so. So let's get on with the second pass here. Let me lather up for this one. Okay, second pass is going to be uh, across the grain on both sides, ears to nose. Okay, the two passes took down a lot of the hair. Still gonna go third pass and maybe a clean up, but this blade is actually very smooth and very sharp. I would say just probably uh, a hair less sharp than feathers, but way sharper than my Vosh gods that I normally use. Okay, this time across the grain, nose to ears. Okay, after three passes, I'm pretty much, I'm going to do a few spots to clean up, but I can see why this is a medical prep blade. I mean, I'm pretty much baby butt smooth after three days, or after three passes. I mean, got myself, I think, one little spot over here, but this thing is extremely smooth, very sharp and gets the job done. All right, let's do a clean up. See, this is why I love sterling. Very thick and cushiony. Get a few clean up spots here that don't really need a whole lot. All right, after three passes, I'm extremely smooth, a little bit on here, but I had some irritation from last week on my neck from using the R41, because I wanted to hurry up and just do one pass, but three passes here, and I'm very happy with this, it's very smooth. I didn't go, I didn't take much on my cleanup pass, but I'm very happy with that. I'm all sweaty, I had to open it. Sorry, I had to open the door because it got very hot in here from my son's bath, but, um, wow. Okay, so, review on this Persona Med Prep blade. This blade, I would say, is for anybody. Now, I don't know how it would be in a, uh, in a more aggressive razor, um, but in my Mula R89, it, it was perfect, um, which is a, a, a moderate razor. Um, did very good. Um, baby butt smooth. Almost uh, after three passes, even if you didn't do a cleanup pass like I did, you, you would be almost there. And I had almost three days of, of growth. Um, I can see why this is a med medical prep blade they use this. Uh, pretty sharp. Um, so, who is this for? I would say anybody. Um, whether you're a beginner or a seasoned wet, sh wet shaver, because this blade is extremely sharp for one. Two, it's extremely smooth. Th this, I have to go look up the price because I didn't look the price up on this because it came in a trial, or not a trial pack, but a, a, a variety pack. I just got 100 blades of um, the, the um, off tryblade.com 
for to try a ton of different blades to do reviews on it. And this one is probably going to be in my rotation. Um, they're probably going to be a little bit more pricey just because they are um, medical prep blades, which they have to go through probably a little bit more processing hygienically to become a uh, medical blade for getting patients ready so that they don't introduce bacteria um, when they start getting them ready for surgery. So um, I'm going to finish up off camera with my uh, aftershave and um, my balm and I'm going to use also some Thayer's Witch Haze before I get all that stuff done. But if you have any questions, comments below, um, like, share my video, um, and have a good shave and have a good night.